This um, monument of the Holy Trinity, as it's called, uh, was put here as a way of um, saying thank you for delivering the town from um, plague. And uh, it's what's 35 meters high tall. And it's got scenes uh, from stuff that's in the New Testament and others showing pictures, it's also got pictures of saints and what have you. But um, one of these, I don't know which one though, uh, but one of them shows, maybe that character in front now, um, a character called John San, uh, uh -huh, Sarkander, John Sarkander, Jan Sarkander, who, um, who uh, was tortured to reveal details um, of um, things that had been said to him in the confessional, but he refused to talk, and the way he was actually tortured, apparently in the museum, he had still got the rack or something. Anyway, he refused to do anything. Now, I'm putting him up here on this uh, was a bit controversial, because all others are saints, and they've sort of been, uh, they've proven their, their worth, but he hadn't. But they put him up, and he was canonized when the um, the Pope John Paul II came here, I think he was in here in 95, I recall rightly. I, th I think that's when he was canonised, I'm not certain. So, uh, anyway, so he got his, uh, he got his reward in heaven, no doubt. It was an extremely brave thing to do. And the people who put him up here, which proven to be correct. Gloria Deo, Patrio Deo, Filio Deo, Paracleto, whatever that may mean. During, uh, this was finished in um, 1754, right? 1758 there was, a, um, there was a siege by the Prussians, and uh, how long this Cannon balls in it, so yeah. So um, anyway, it took a couple of hits, and the delegation of the citizens went out to uh, ask the Prussian general not to uh, fire at it if he, if he didn't mind too much, and uh, apparently didn't mind too much, and so he stopped firing at it, and they were very grateful for it. Mind didn't mind killing people and knocking houses down, but he didn't not not, not miss them. Um, one or two of the uh, Sculptors actually died because of lead poisoning uh, produced in the moulds or something. Uh, lead poisoning is, of course, a very common uh, thing to make people either go crazy. We have the expression mad as a hatter, because they support Luton football team. And uh, that comes from the lead that was used in hat manufacture. Well, of course, this was not known until many, many years later. Magnificent structure then. Something similar, I'm told, in Prague. And this thing here itself is based on something in Rome.